Hi, welcome to Shop Wild Things Video Time with Tina. Today we're having celebration time with our celebration lights or otherwise known as our balloon lights, which can be used for a lot more than just the balloons, but we have the lights down low so that you can see the extra interest that it takes in the balloons when you have lighting, especially in the night event. Uh, when you have the balloons in the corner of the room where there's not a whole lot of lighting, whole lot of lighting, it adds that extra pop and just makes it look sensational and more of a celebrational type of decor. And I have over here a, a very uh, narrow Eiffel Tower vases. Our customers are always asking us, what kind of a light can you use in the Eiffel Tower vases? The balloon lights are perfect to use in the Eiffel Tower vases for uh, down that narrow neck. And you can also light up your centerpieces, your feathers or your flowers with the small celebration balloon lights. And also we have, um, you know, just a little toasting glass with a a balloon light added on a simple bow to give it more of a celebrational look in the evening, which makes it very nice. We're going to bring the lights up uh, in the room now so that we can show you how easy it is to do some of the things that you're seeing here that you're looking at. So the toasting flute just has a simple balloon light that we've tied to the the flute itself and and it's sitting in front or in back of the actual bow. The balloon lights are very easy to use. You just simply, when the balloon is not filled up, you lower this into the neck of the balloon. But first, before you do that, you do want to pull out the little white activation strip. You want to turn it on and then lower it in the neck of the balloon put your helium into the balloon and the string stays out of the balloon and you just tie your balloon and put your strings all the way through that tie and you have the lit balloons. And you can, because the latex is pliable, you can actually keep your balloons lights turned off by kind of pinching it and turning it off and then turning it on again when you get into the event. The balloon lights last eight hours. so. You know, they're going to last, it is a little bit tedious to take all of those and do it. Once you do one or two, you get the hang of it, but you could keep them on. They would last up to eight hours. And for the Eiffel Tower vase that you see here, you know, we've just got the feathers in the vase. And I um, had a little one that would, for a little bit of up lighting on the vase behind the feathers. And then we simply lowered on a string and taped it to the side of the vase with some of our glue dots, uh, all of the balloon lights to lower down in there. So you can do that with so many different things. They have so many different uses. You can be so creative with them. So I hope you've enjoyed this segment of Shop Wild Things Video Time with Tina, and we'll see you next time.